I'm turning now to our live interview. We have Briley here this morning with the Midland Humane Coalition. Now, joining her is our friend Carlos. He's been a good. Is it is Carlos a boy? I'd imagine Carlos, Carlos is, is a boy. boy. Okay, great. Well, Carlos is a Chihuahua, correct? Correct. Now, you were telling us earlier that you're ready for today's interview with some cool Chihuahua facts. <laughs> what are you going to tell us today? Well, obviously Chihuahuas were originated in Chihuahua, Mexico. Okay. That's an easy one. Um, let's see, what else? Are you already out? You only got one? <laughs> well, I've got to think <laughs> about them. I told her this morning that I was going to make her dance with Carlos on her head, and she looked like, are you serious? <laughs> are, are you ready to dance? Yeah, yeah. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> now, for those interested in adopting a pet from you guys, talk to me a little bit about what you guys offer those wanting to adopt. So, we offer a microchipped, vaccinated pet, and they're fully healthy, all fixed, and they'll be a nice companion to have. Is it so. a pretty, pretty easy process? I mean, can you go in and within, uh -huh. you know, a couple of hours walk out with a dog oh, yeah. or cat? Probably less than a couple of hours. Okay, what, what do you have to have ready? So, you need to have your ID, and so it's a fee, so there's $150 for a dog. Okay. And I believe 110 for a cat, so. Okay, very cool. How long have you been with the Humane Coalition? About a year. About a year. Why, why do you like volunteering? And I, I guess if somebody's watching this morning and may want to be volunteering, I guess, how would you sell um, to try to get a volunteer? So, this Monday we have volunteer orientation. So things they can volunteer with are be, would be the fur ball coming up in September. What is the fur ball? So the fur ball, is that's a, it's a kind of a party-like thing. For, but it's a fundraiser for the animals, and it's at the Petroleum Club. Okay, do you have to dress up in formal wear? I mean, is it kind of like when you say a ball, I'm thinking like gowns and tuxedos and stuff. Do you have to dress up? I think so. <laughs> okay. I'm pretty sure. I <laughs> well, as always, we'll be sharing more information about all of the events with the Midland Humane Coalition. And if you would like to take Carlos home, he's looking for a forever home this morning, you can find it on our website. Now, if you missed today's interview, check out yourbasin.com. We'll post it for you there.